Charles Benson was with the Hamilton family while they watched Chief Flynn's announcement. And he joins us live from downtown. Charles. And Dontre Hamilton's family watched and listened to that news conference right here. You know, for six months they have been pushing for some sort of response, some sort of resolution to this issue, to what happened nearly six months ago at Red Arrow Park. Today they feel like they got one answer, but they believe that there are more answers out there, and they say this case is far from over. Hugs for Dontre Hamilton's family as they arrived at police headquarters. The family watched the news conference on today's TMJ4 as Chief Flynn explained why he fired the officer. We're happy um, that this is it's, it's showing that Dontre shouldn't have been approached in the first place. He wasn't doing anything wrong. The family still struggles with the department's version of the sequence of events. They don't believe the officer's life was in jeopardy when he fired multiple times at Dontre. Yes, the plus that he was fired, uh, but he took a man's life and anybody like any other citizen will go to jail. The use of force is now being reviewed by the district attorney and it will be up to the DA to decide if criminal charges are warranted. An employee shot a man 14, 15 times, and now the agency has taken the appropriate step in the employment process. But the chief is saying this is not a use of force issue. He's saying that there was a constitutional violation at the outset in the unlawful search and seizure, which started it. So the police chief has done all he can here. This case does move and has been in front of the district attorney's office for a couple of months. And the issue there is the DA is looking for outside help, a second opinion on this question of use of force. But according to the DA's office today, they do not expect any decision to be coming down this week. We're live inside the police administration building. Charles Benson, today's TMJ4. All right, thank you, Charles.